Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. I've got chewing gum in my mouth, in my mouth right now and I'm red, very, very hot. Um, we've just touched down in Milan. The flight was so short, we were literally on the plane for like an hour and a half. Happy to be back vlogging again and just, yeah, keeping you updated with what's happening over the next two days. So I'm shooting a ski campaign for PLT. Um, it's not coming out for a while yet, but I thought I'd just do like a bit of a chilled vlog and just show you what I get up to whilst we're on a ski shoot. It's gonna be a bit different to normal. I've not done a cold shoot, like in the snow. My one's there. Oh. Get it all. Thank you. Um, yeah, we've not done a cold shoot in, uh, no. We've not done a cold shoot in so, so long. Um, we normally always go away to like hot locations to do like hot shoots with nice sunny weather. So it's gonna be really nice to do something a bit different and do it with snow. I need to put this chewing gum out because it's probably all you can see. We're having to travel quite far because it's not actually ski season yet. It's not actually very snowy anywhere. So we have to do a lot of research um, into finding somewhere that's gonna be snowy enough to make it like a cool ski campaign and stuff. I think that's Holly's case though, the white one, isn't it? Why do I know everyone's cases? That's weird. <laughs> We've got a long drive now to the hotel. I think it's like two or three hours. I need to give this camera lens a clean as well, it's so dirty. We're just having a look at this food place before we get in the car for the next two hours and I actually can't deal with these little Halloween treats even though Halloween was over yesterday. So cute, I didn't see anything like this in the UK this year. Hey guys, so we have finally touched down at our hotel in, is it Milan that we're in? Because yeah, we've flown yeah. to Milan, but we were in the car for literally like three hours traveling to our hotel. And when we were on the final roads, like getting close to our hotel, it literally felt like we were in Germany or Austria. I actually used to go on ski trips with my school. Um, I used to love skiing and it just literally reminded me so much of the ski trips I used to go to to Austria. Um, it looks so similar, but we're actually in Italy. So the room is so, so, so cozy. I literally feel like we're in a scene from a film right now and then we just open our balcony doors and it's so snowy outside. It's so cold. Our call time tomorrow is 5.30 in the morning. Oh, also excuse how greasy I am. I seriously need to get a shower. Uh, but I'll do you a quick little room tour. It's like the cutest thing ever. Also, if anyone wants to know where Erin's sleeping tonight. <laughs> This is Erin's bed. <laughs> Joking, imagine. Um, this is like a weird little room, which I'm actually gonna keep shut because it's kind of a little bit spooky. Bit I don't really know why that's there. So here is our little chalet ski room. They've left some treats here for us and some Starbucks. What's this? Caramel macchiato and a little, I think that's a little latte. And some chocolate, some flowers, which is so beautiful. And yeah, this is the room. So, so, so cozy. The lighting is quite dark, but I think it just makes it even cozier. I'm going to put the TV on. This is actually like a jacuzzi bath. Um, so you take the top off this, it's like um, one of those big jacuzzi baths. And then you won't be able to see out here. But in the morning, I would show you. There's actually a river, big lake thing down there. And it's so snowy, but you won't be able to see. So I'll show you that in the morning. That is us in our cozy little chalet room. And Erin and I are so obsessed with coziness. <laughs> like when um, it rains and stuff in Manchester, me and Erin are like, yeah. Like we get so weird about it. We love like being inside and being warm and cozy and this room is like the epitome of cozy. So really happy right now. We're gonna have a shower, sort ourselves out, maybe unpack a little bit. You're still in it. You're still in it. We're just on our way down for dinner. The dress oh, dress oh. This is right. oh my god. <laughs> so scary what did you press minus one, one. <laughs> you press minus one you're oh. idiots we just went into a dungeon with a, with a hole in the book <laughs> anyway the as i was saying they said us to come down for dinner in smart casual and this is us <laughs> but we've been traveling all day so that's just that i can't go over what i've just seen oh we've we got, got penne i mean there is only like three tubes of penne um, so I might order another portion because I lack my food and yeah. me and Holly are actually going to be so, sharing. Yeah. Oh yeah, one more here. Thank you. Yeah, Ooh, we're going to be splitting this. Oh, there's a few more here. We we'll split that and that. Oh no. <laughs> Baba, let me get it. Oh no. I'm dirted. Oh, no. Are you going to hit? 
Yeah. So for dessert, we got a creme brulee. Thank you. Looks stunning. And then we also got this creamy concoction. I don't know what this is. Oh yeah, chocolate gatto. <laughs> Oh, this is good. <laughs> <laughs> She's an idiot. ASMR. I'm just going to test this. Good morning, guys. So, greetings. I look a little bit crazy. The hair and makeup's done. The ski outfit is on. And we're about to leave now to start shooting. I'll just take this off whilst I'm talking to you guys so I don't look crazy. Um, but yeah, early start, 5.30 a.m. Hence why I didn't start vlogging when I had no hair and makeup on because I had to have a shower, wash my hair, and the shower was ice cold. We couldn't get it to warm up. So that was a nice fresh start to the day. Um, last night we literally just had dinner, four billion bowls of pasta um, to carb up for today to stay nice and warm, get the food in our bellies. Um, and yeah, now we have a full day shooting. So I'm gonna head out now. Everyone's waiting for us downstairs as per usual. Um, the first outfit is this really nice cream one with a faux fur hood. We've done this really, really long um, wavy hair just because I think I'm gonna be wearing a helmet because I can actually ski. So we're gonna do some cool shots of me skiing, which I need to wear a helmet for. So we thought we'd do long hair so you can still see it while I've got a helmet on because obviously safety first. I need to get used to um, shooting in ski wear because normally I'm wearing like nice sort of fluttering tight clothes. Um, it's super different shooting ski. So I'm really excited to do something a little bit different. And this is absolutely beautiful, this set. Uh, it's a pair of silver pets and then a nice jacket as well. Oh my God, I cannot believe. <gasps> Look at this, I feel like I'm in a film. I can't believe that last night when we turned up, it was pitch black and we had no idea that this was literally surrounding us. <gasps> I feel like I'm in like a Toblerone advert or something. <laughs> this doesn't feel real. It's absolutely unbelievable and soon I'm going to be zim zimmering. Oh wait, to be fair, that's not actually the mountain we're going to be going down, but this is just unbelievable. I believe A whole loop. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you not actually have a normal bag? <laughs> Good time. <laughs> Everything's in there, like everything. Everything we really We are about to get on this cable car to get up the mountain. And Holly, my makeup artist, absolutely hates lifts and all kinds of things. So we're literally gonna have to like shove her on because there's literally no other way up the mountain. We can't exactly walk up there. So yeah, we're gonna get on the cable car and get up. I think it's gonna take like, I think it's like 40 minutes to get up, which is a long, long cable car. It's really strict to get on the cable car. You needed a negative COVID test. They're really strict out here. Not on the ice. Oh, oh, all right, dad. Goodness. Oh no, I hope I don't fall. I can't see. Hello? Hello, friends. Very cold, but staying really positive and happy. One look done. On to the next. Panini. For 11.30 snack. <laughs> Before another snack, I don't know what will be next, but we could do that chocolate and stuff, couldn't we? Mm. Chocolate shots. Look one. And now we're on to look two, which is this all-in-one black set with a balaclava. And I've worn moon boots, these moon boots, for the first time. Maybe the comfiest thing I've ever put on my foot. It literally feels like I'm walking on clouds. Um, it's gotten really windy and cloudy outside, so we're just trying to work with the weather. And the hair, because obviously we've got the hair down, but the second I step outside, it's like a gale blowing everywhere. I'll try and get some footage of it so you can see just how windy it is. Um, so maybe we'll do another look with the hair down and then pop it back up because it's kind of hard to work with, but it's going really well. We have just finished shooting the second look. It's super duper cold. And when I take these goggles off, it is so bright. So I'm just gonna leave them on, even though like a bug. Holly's not loving me right now because I've probably removed half the makeup from wearing these goggles, but it's really challenging shooting in this weather, but I'm enjoying it. It's good, like it's nice to have a challenge to do something different. Okay, this is the team. We're all working so hard. Like everyone in the team has their own different jobs. Oh my gosh! Do you guys want lunch? Erin, look at this! Look at that little snowflake in there! Yeah, I don't <gasps> oh my god, it's oh, so cool! Like... Oh no! Oh my god!
God, no Molly, that one there. Wait, where? Oh, I can't go over how these are like, literally like the perfect snow. It's like we're in Frozen or something. Let it go, let it go. Wow. Can't hold it back anymore. So yeah, this is us. We're going to go upstairs now. We're halfway through. So guys, I am going to do some skiing now. Real life skiing. The ski boots are on. I feel like I'm in um, cool runnings right now, the bobsleigh team. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna get up to the top of the mountain. We're gonna ski down and hopefully get some really cool shots from the campaign. speechless so this evening we were so tired that we didn't feel like we could go out for the dinner at the hotel after a full day of shooting so we wanted to get room service but I think what we've discovered just now is that this hotel doesn't do room service and that they decided to bring a full table from the restaurant with candles cutlery chairs to our room and now I feel terribly bad he just turned up to the door with a table and I was like oh my god what's going on also don't mind the state of me because um my, are you blowing them out? Should we not? Oh yeah, it's fine, yeah. We've got no space. Aww. We've got no words. <laughs> We're sat at, at a table in our room, eating, I'm, I'm speechless. I'm delirious from how tired I am. I don't know, it just sat on my face because she laughed. Anyway, this is the room service we've got. We've got a steak, Pasta, pizza, <laughs> more pasta. We're literally going to turn into a penny pasta if we're not careful at this rate. But yeah, we're going to dig in. I promise I do actually wash these pyjamas. I feel like every single vlog I come in, I'm wearing my favourite rainbow pyjamas. I have these as well in the lobster print. I think you guys have seen me wear them before. Erin and I are now tucked up in bed after the longest day. I feel like I got a bit rubbish at vlogging whilst I was skiing and shooting and all that stuff but it's not an easy thing to do like especially on a shoot like this to remember to vlog whilst your hands have frostbite and your nose is hanging on by a thread because of how cold it is and it actually also has frostbite um i don't actually know how we made it through because it was a blizzard to be fair it wasn't actually that bad i did expect it to be i, I expected it to be the way it was it's meant to be terrible weather tomorrow which i'm a little bit gutted about because we've still got loads to do so i think we're going to do a little bit actually inside the hotel because it's a beautiful hotel um and it's kind of got like ski chalet vibes one thing that's tricky about these trips i'm not complaining or moaning but you there's literally no way of eating healthy like we've literally eaten pasta for breakfast lunch and dinner basically um the last two days because there's just not really options to get healthy food but i'm really excited to get back home and get back into a bit of a routine because my life has genuinely been all over the place the last few weeks. Anyway, I'm going to start waffling now because I need to put my camera on charge. It's got battery for tomorrow so I can vlog and show you what we get up to. I'll try and show you a bit more tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I hope you're enjoying this vlog and I'll catch you in the morning. Good morning, guys. So I am up, out, ready for the day. The makeup is done, the hair is done. We did have a small problem with the hair. I think I told you guys in the Beauty Works event vlog that my ponytail was absolutely killing me. Um, and the same thing happened this morning. Jack put my ponytail in and I was like, no, 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 the pain. It's like your head has an actual heartbeat. And I was like, I just actually cannot, I cannot deal with that throbbing today. So we had to take it out, put it back in a couple of times, but now it feels absolutely fine. No pain whatsoever. I just, I cannot deal when I'm like uncomfortable like, to enjoy my day and to be in like the best mood possible. I have to be comfy, feel, comfy like not in pain i mean obviously anyway um it's snowing today well, it's, it's not really snowing anymore but it was snowing a little bit um nothing that's gonna like stop us from shooting though it's actually quite nice for the pictures in the video um so yeah i'm wearing this all-in-one snowsuit now that we've just shot and i'm not wearing any thermals or anything underneath this and it's literally so warm so 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 warm and these boots the moon boots i'm i mean i mean i've raved about them yesterday but i really am a massive fan i'm gonna buy them as soon as i get home and wear them around town because they're really great so now we've shot look one the plan is to get back up the mountain i don't know if i'm gonna be doing any more skiing today it breaks my heart but um this has made me so desperate to go on a ski holiday but none of my friends can ski which is so upsetting like no i don't really know anyone that can ski so i don't know who would come with me and tommy can't really come because he's an athlete and I don't think athletes are actually allowed to ski. I did have like a weird 
down moment this morning because I'd, I've literally eaten rubbish for the last 48 hours and it, I was saying last night like it affects my mood so so much and I woke up this morning and had to have like a croissant because there was actually nothing else Ooh. Um, and it just affects my mood so so much so I'm trying to be a bit healthier today because eating all those carbs it made me feel just absolutely pants yesterday helicopter here's a little full length these outfits I actually just cannot deal with them they are so so unreal like the quality of these PRT ski outfits just second to none. This is just where we've been shooting. Um, I love the apres ski vibes of this. Kylie actually, um, the Kardashians came on a ski trip not that long ago um, and they did loads of pictures in like a really cool hotel just like this, like a fireplace, which there is one inside there. Um, really reminded me of that, but the views here, honestly, like I said yesterday, I do feel like I'm just constantly in a Toblerone advert here. <laughs> I don't even know where that's come from because I don't think the Toblerone advert has been out for literally years, but... Um, it's just absolutely stunning and weirdly like I thought I was going to hate being cold and being in the snow and stuff and was going to be thinking oh, I wish I was doing like a hot shoot but this has actually been so 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 amazing and I even said on my Instagram story yesterday like I feel like these mountains and the snow and like this is like my happy place because I've just been in like a really like content nice mood the last two days I don't know why it's just something about like the air and like just the nature and everything it's just so so nice to be around not the best mirror to be able to see this in but this is the next look this black all-in-one I think this could be one of my favorites and now I've got fluffy moon boots on I actually need to stop going on about these moon boots because that's all I've spoken about in this vlog um but yeah I love this black all-in-one so it's kind of it's shiny sections here it's got a faux fur hood so we've just got to the set location and i ordered a hot chocolate now i actually just think this is oh my oh my god that is not a hot chocolate that's just melted chocolate I mean, it looks stunning. Maybe if I mix it a little bit, it might solidify and turn into a liquid because right now that's actually just like you've put chocolate in a microwave. This is the reality of trying to get the outfits on when you've had your hair and makeup done and it's all thermals. Over and out, Jack. Please be careful. Over. I think the other way first. Come on. Wow. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh. <laughs> She's in. She's in. So Thank you, team. That was great work. Great teamwork. Didn't even touch my face, you know. Good girl. You're welcome. Because I had Holly threatening me. That's right, Holly threatened me. <laughs> Once again, <laughs> we are having <laughs> pasta <laughs> for lunch. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hello. Jack, what did you get? Lasagna. Lasagna? Mm. Same, cool. so did I. Mm. I got lasagna too. It's really yummy. I hate having to just slide in here when I'm in Manchester right now, I'm just quickly interject because this vlog is not going to make any sense if I don't. For some reason, I didn't decide to let you guys know what was going on at this moment in time. And it just literally goes from like us having lunch whilst shooting the campaign to a fox, a pregnant, adorable fox that we found like near our hotel. And us having, without a doubt, probably the best night of my life, I'm not even joking. You're not going to believe me when I say hand on heart the footage that you're about to see of us dancing and going crazy. Well, to be fair, I can't say this for everybody, but I was stone cold sober. It might not look like it, but I was stone cold sober. Basically, to cut a long story short, we were in the bar area of our hotel. We were like the only people staying there. It was so quiet. And we found these like old vinyl players. I wouldn't even know what you call them. Like, you know, like the old things that play like vinyls. Um, and Ben and Harry, the videographers that were on the shoot that work with, we work with them all the time. They worked out how to use this like vinyl player. And we were like choosing all like really old music that none of us knew what any of the music was. And we were literally just putting the weirdest songs on and just dancing the whole night until like literally like 4 a.m i was in slippers and a tracksuit and no makeup and just like surrounded by people that i absolutely love and like my plt team and my team and oh, it was just literally the best night ever so if you're looking at this footage thinking what on earth is going on that is what's going on
ten minutes. Ooh, Starbucks. Thank you, Erin. Thank you, Molly. <laughs> 30 minutes. So guys, we have just got to the airport now. We had such a late night, night last night. I didn't vlog. I did vlog a little bit, but um, I think I'm going to have done a little talk through bit at home to insert to explain some of the footage that you have seen from last night because it literally was the funniest night of my life. Um, Holly and Erin have just got us to Starbucks now and we're about to get on the plane. I look like I've had 30 minutes sleep and that's because I have. I literally have slept for about two seconds. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited to get home. So I will catch up with you when I get back to Manchester. So yeah, that's that. We're back in Manchester now. It was just the most incredible trip. Like I had the best time away in the Alps. Like I definitely want to go back. Like I said in the vlog, um, I really, really want to go on like a proper ski trip now and um, find like a friend to go with because it was just such a breath of fresh air, quite literally, because it was very fresh out there, but it was like a breath of fresh air to do something different and go on like a cold shoot. Um, it was a real challenge and I absolutely loved it. Like I really enjoyed, like it was really hard work. Probably not the best vlog footage I've ever captured, but I still want to put this vlog out nonetheless because I don't know, I was watching it back just then and I absolutely love it. Like, I really like this vlog. It's just the best memories. Um, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this vlog anyway. If you stuck around to the end and made it till now, then I love you all so much. And hopefully I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.